The six athletes are Timothy Tuna, Israel Tucker, Adolf Kauba, Emmanuel Anis, Johnny Bai, and the only female athlete, Mary Tange. The train and study program, which has been in existence for some time now, has continued to provide more advanced and consistent training and competitions for past, current, and emerging young athletes to develop their sporting career further. The program also provides study opportunities for athletes to further their education. Athletics PNG President Tony Green, who's accompanying the athletes, left early today for the U.S. ahead of the six athletes who are scheduled to travel on Friday via Brisbane. Green said the athletes will be based at New Mexico Junior College that runs a program similar to the one started a few years ago in Kansas where Lini Bao and Isila Apkup attended and will be better for the sprinters, especially the boys 100 meter and 200 meter. Green said New Mexico Junior College has a good program all year round and would be good for the athletes as part of the ongoing program aimed at retaining athletes in the squad while also giving them the opportunity to continue their education and training. New Mexico Junior College has a good all-round program, so I think it'll be really good for these athletes. While giving a brief outline on the program, Green said the athletes are excited and looking forward to taking this lifetime opportunity with both hands, knowing they have worked hard for it. I think it's a really good opportunity for the athletes and, you know, for, uh, for obviously for our strengthening our team. The Green said the program is aligned to the PNG Athletics calendar and is part of the preparation for the athletes for next year's mini games in Palau and the Pacific game in 2027 in Tahiti. For East Pacific Sprint Machine, Emmanuel Anis, going back to the U.S. is like homecoming as he's been there before studying and training. He was based in Kansas back then, but he's excited to go back to the new school with the new athletes. Everyone's pretty excited about this new program because uh, the school that we're going to is a, is a very competitive school. They have a lot of runners that com uh, competed and uh, have been, uh, been um, able to perform at the World Championships. For young Simbules and long-distance runner Mary Tange, she joined athletics when doing grade 5 and has never looked back. She's excited and looking forward to the trip. Sprinter Johnny Bay of Mix Brantage, Boca, New Ireland, East and West New Britain is also excited about his prospect. And yeah, my big thanks to Athletics PNG for giving me this opportunity. Probably like when we go down there, it's like we're gonna go and get into like um, training. So like I think I'm gonna focus more on that. But then when school starts now, I'll try to balance it out as I go on. Terry Longwood, TV One Sports.